My name is C.P. Mohamed Guy. Uh, today we are doing a cost accounting question that was tested in July 2016. The question is about overhead analysis sheet. We are told Taifa Enterprises has two production departments, A and B, and one service department, C. The following overheads were incurred by the firm in the month of July 2016. They are given the rent. The amount is 480, in direct wages, 360, insurance of machinery, 90,000, electricity, 40,000, staff canteen, you have indirect material for department A is 60,000, B is 6,000, C is 10,000. Additional information here now you are provided the base of apportionment. For example, area for department A is 30, B is 60, then C is 30. Number of staff so like that. Additional information. The overheads of service departments are to be reapportioned to department A and B in the ratio of 4 to 1. Now, after you have done the overhead distribution schedule, then again the examiner requires you to reapportion the overhead of service department C to production department of A and B. Let's do it. So come here and write overhead distribution schedule. Overhead distribution schedule. We will start with a column for overhead. And then you will have basis of apportionment. Basis of apportionment. And then we have here a ratio. You will have a column for amount. And then the various department, for example, we have department A, everything B, and then we have department C. Now the first overhead here, you are given is rent and the amount is 306,000, so you write here rent. Now this apportionment for rent is area and then you come here, area for the basement you are given 30, you are given 60 and then you are given uh, 10. So you will look for a common a divisible number for 36 and 10. And then if you divide here by 10, this will become 1, 1 ratio 6, ratio 3. So it becomes 3 to ratio 6, and then ratio 1. And then you will write the amount of the overhead. For example, credit is shilling 480. Now, you need to determine the shareable of the overhead for department service de for production department A. You will say 3, 3 divided by 10. We, will just, we are adding the, the simplified ratio. 3 plus 6 plus 1, that is 10. 3 over 10, and then multiply by 480. Do that. So you will get one hundred forty four thousand for production department A, one hundred forty four thousand for production department A, and then you need to determine for production department B also. By doing 6 over 10 by 480,000.
and then we will get 288,000 and lastly Eight thousand for service department C. Then we close it. And then the same for the next overhead we have is insurance of machinery. Insurance of machinery. And then the insurance of machinery, that being the overhead, the base of apportionment becomes up. The book value, the book value of the machinery, here, yeah? value of the machinery, value of the machinery, the book value, or the value of the machinery, still okay. Now the piece of apportionment, ratio, here you are only given the ratio for production department A and B that is 6 4 and then what goes you will write the amount, sorry amount here is 90,000 90,000 done the shareable amount of the overhead for production department A becomes what? 6 over 10, then multiply by 90,000. That becomes fifty four thousand. The lesson of the table, the shareable amount of overhead for production department B, say four divided by ten, then multiply by ninety thousand, you get that six thousand. Now for service department. C. Then the next one is indirect wages. Our next overhead is indirect wages. And then base of apportionment for indirect wages is number of staffs. And then the ratio. Number of staffs is painting then pressure of two left pressure of three ten pressure of two left pressure of three and if you want to determine the amount for the overhead for indirect wages indirect wages Amount is three hundred and sixty thousand. Write it here, three hundred and sixty thousand. Then you need to determine out the shareable amount of uh, overhead for production department A. So then you will say is three plus twenty two plus three twenty five. Then you will say ten over twenty five multiplied by three sixty. Thank
gives you 144,000 for production department A, and then total divided by 25 for production department B. Then you multiply this 60,000. Get one seventy two thousand eight hundred. One seventy two thousand eight hundred. And then lastly, for surface department C, we will say three divided by two five, and then multiply three hundred and sixty thousand. So you get forty three thousand two hundred. 